It's now three days before the premiere. It's uh, Monday, premieres on Thursday. Um, and I've just had the most extraordinary couple of hours. I wouldn't say maybe the extraordinary, most extraordinary hours of my life, but really pretty close, meeting 20 of the contributors to the film. And it was like the oddest dinner party ever imagined by anybody. You had, you know, people from the four corners of the globe there, um, all meeting each other for the first time, nothing in common at all in their lives except for the fact they've contributed to this film. And first of all, they're all really, really nice. And secondly, it's quite weird because I've been used to seeing them in two dimensions, always doing the same thing every day, and suddenly they're saying other words. So they seem to actually be alive, and it's quite a shock. Um, and just seeing out there just now, seeing Abel, who's a little boy from Peru, and Tai Ch Chan, I think his name is, from, from, from Japan, from Tokyo. And these two little boys have been brought together by this project, and they were playing and running and fighting each other in the corridor there. And I thought, wow, that's really, that's the power of film, isn't it? The power of YouTube, maybe. Um, so that was pretty, that was pretty special. Um, the whole thing's pretty special. It's, it's, quite, it's quite emotional. Today we had our first kind of proper screening of the movie. We had a press screening for, you know, any press who wanted to come today. And we seem to have had a good response. All the feedback we've had has been really positive. Um, uh, but of course, we're still a bit nervous. We don't really know how it's going to go down with the public. Uh, we've got another press screening tomorrow. I guess there'll start be some reviews over the next couple of days. Uh, so, yeah, we're beginning to, it's all coming to fruition. It could all, our hopes could all be dashed on the rocks of criticism. We could have, um, you know, you're so in the hands of these few little critics who are the ones who decide whether things are good or bad. So it's always a nerve wracking, nerve wracking state of affairs. I've actually never been to Sundance before. I think I've been to pretty much every other major festival and I've never been here and I've always wanted to come. So it's a thrill to be here. It's, it's fantastic atmosphere and fantastic just to think all these films are going on. So many good films unspooling. I keep being told about, oh, that film was great and that film was great. And you really feel like you're at the, the heart of independent cinema. So it's the right place for us to be with this film.